best one. Right. Now, Anthony, was he, was he a fisherman? No. No. He liked to go out for sports. He liked the sports, huh? Sports. The balls, huh? Right. Always, he was, he was a landman. He liked to land. That's correct. <laughs> and he liked to play the football. Yep. Oh, yeah. Now, do you still fish down here with the boats? No, no. How about up in Alaska? Alaska, San Francisco. Oh, yeah. But Anthony used to come down to the boathouse all the time, didn't he? Well, he used to help my father. Yeah. When he, uh, when, he when Anthony got into uh, high school, he really went for the football. And then the coaching and everything. Right. Yeah, and then he came down and helped my dad when I was in the service. Oh, he did? Yeah. Helped his father and helped my mom. <laughs> Anything else? Yeah. Hold it. About Anthony? Yeah, we were up in Idaho. And Danny, myself, Nino Balechi, uh, Jack, and uh, Leo Russo went up fishing. Anthony had short boots. We all wore waders. And we're going across the stream, and it was too deep for Anthony, so Danny and I lift them up and carried them across. That day we came back, and of course, we were a little tired then. Then we had to carry him back across the. <laughs> and uh, everybody started laughing, so we dropped him in the middle of the stream.
Fantastic. And we want to thank Van Boschetti for helping us. This time in the program, our honoree is, 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 is Anthony Pellegrini. It's obvious. 
And I'd like to call on a few people, if they're prepared or not prepared, to say a few words about our honoree. Tootie, you're not saying yet. <laughs> <laughs> Tootie's over there with a look of shock. He's got the opera before him. You will sing, but not yet. <laughs> Charlie, is there anything you'd like to say? Charlie Zeno, everybody. Well, as you all know, I've been around the county for a few years, and uh, I think the way I got started, you know, this gentleman right next to me, I'm not trying to uh, yeah. run any cold water over Anthony, who was a no, no. Uh, John and I, we worked with, I think, for $5 a week each, and all we could drink, Pepsi-Cola. Yeah. <laughs> he was with the Gazette, and I was with the Post-Dispatch, and we tried to do a job covering uh, the county as well as we could. I would take the east end, and he would take the west end, and it's because of guys like John that I became exposed to people like Anthony Pellegrini. And it was at that time I really learned this guy, he was real, he was a real bear. You know, I've seen a lot of centers in this county, and he's probably the best I've ever seen. Uh, and I know what he is as a gentleman. I wasn't aware of the things he had done in the community. And thanks, Van, for inviting me here because I know the guy was kind of special, but Jesus. Yeah. Uh, he, he went 30 feet high in my opinion tonight. Thanks for having me here. Thank you, Charlie. Nobody knows the Giants in him because he was the greatest pitcher we had in the sixth grade. That's right. <laughs> of course, a man who I feel I don't know what to say. This man is uh, more or less done that he's done this tonight. I, I argued with him, but he said we have to have it. The only reason I don't know why, but we're here tonight. It's a great dinner. I enjoyed everything because of this man and. Yes, other person over here, Mr. Boskin. Right. Uh, this committee. I thought you got to remember, I started somewhere, right? I started with the Boschetti family, Mr. Carl Drexel. I know many of you know Mr. Carl Drexel. <laughs> He's a nice person, and Van, ever since I can remember. Dad says, my dad used to send you a message, and I said, that's right, because your father and son can never talk about football. <laughs> before, one hour before practice and after practice. <laughs> you have to have it. <laughs> no problem. Mr. McGuire, of course, McGuire is my neighbor, and great, great track tradition. Now, I'll tell you, he's still running, and a great... A great flag football player, triple reverse, double oh. reverse. We pray for the days of 1912. <laughs> of course, Johnny Rodriguez and Mr. Zeno, people, I, I'm really still amazed that they came to this party, and I really appreciate it. And then, of course, Nikki. Nikki Kapaya is my linebacker, center. I always put these people in the mold that... I figured they can chew nails or spit out teeth, one of the two. Yeah. And Mr. Nichols, poor Nichols, I put him in the backfield. I said, you're my tailback. He looked at me and says, Coach, I think I want to be a half. I said, tailback, you're the greatest. <laughs> and of course, <laughs> Mr. Phil Salini, God, who knows? Philly was my idol. I can remember my uncle Johnny used to take me down to Wilson. 
and we go over there and have cherry cokes in the corner of the Main and Ferry. Good times. That was in the 40s. You don't even remember that. You weren't even, you couldn't even remember that. What are you laughing about? And Richie, Richie, how do you know? Richie, I give him two plays at one time. We, lost, we, won, we had a game against Pleasant Hill. We were behind 24, 24 seconds. And I says, Richie, you've got to be the decoy. We're going to call two plays. One is, Richie, you run a pass pattern post 50 yards down the field. And I says, you fake him out because he had scored a touchdown. 50-yard pass play against Pleasant Hill. You know who the coach was? Ed Hall. He's a DVC right now. So I says, and we have little Jimmy Boyd, we're going to sneak him behind everybody. Two timeouts, I says, one timeout, two plays, 24 seconds. He says, you fake him out, Richie, and Jimmy, you run this pattern. You know what? Jimmy ran uh, 72 yards, beat him in the last second because Richie knew how to score that play the time before. He screwed everything up and he made that game. <laughs> You know Dickie, he's come a long ways in many respects. He has things going. His flag football, he had the greatest hits beside Lawrence Hill. Those two guys, they used to give a distance. <laughs> this may be the only, unless oh, Durko's the only single class. Oh, that's that's the only the others, and they're not going to take the team. got no kind of service. Is it 54 teams that's under consideration? 41 teams? Are you the president of the team? I'm not sure. Wait, is it really hard to have his stomach? Yeah, he's organizing. I'll make sure he's organizing. As long as Tom is on the Tony's best league. Can women join the old Hill? I don't know. You'd have to talk to Tom Barlett. He makes his rules. He makes he makes his rules late at night when no one else is around. He talks to his father, and you got to talk to his father. They make up and then they come and they do it. And I don't know what the hell. Rosalie's. Uh, but they I have two sons. Leo got married. And when, whenever they say that, it's like summer. You can say so. We all went to Lost Medals. You can say I was the first oh. inductee. If I'm the first, and of course, me. First told us in our community. Yeah. I get down there, and I was hit with it. was pretty good. Very advertising point. And yes. There. Remember, there first martini person. <laughs> Let it be your umbrella. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, we get uh, we get there and go to the wedding and we go well, to the set. Going out there when I'm getting slammed. I can tell it was fun. Yeah, with all my cousins, that was great. you know, really having a great time. So. You did a good job. The boys. We had a good time. Johnny, yeah, he's a weird full house. He's a weird old. I don't know, I'm going to say that. I'm going to say that. They stand in these people. What night do you play? Tuesday? Oh, what do you want? I'll play with the bar. Oh, yeah, I'm going to play with the house. That way I can remember what I'm going to play with. Yeah, right. I'm going to play with the house. I'm going to play with the house. So that, they, they got the keys away from you, you know, because they were going to let me drive back to Martinez. Remember what I told like you? The smallest one here for sure. Right. Right. You know what? It's Rocky. 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 You know, and I just can't so so friends and we'll play everybody else. Friends and years and I'm talking 30 to 40 years ago. No, no, I, I, I will play. So how you been, Tom? How you feeling? Damn thing just burned, man.